Hello, Andy and fans. Michael O'Sullivan here at Crawford Court as we preview the upcoming Big West Conference Tournament for the UC Irvine men's basketball team. That time of year again for the Anteaters looking to defend their title at the Honda Center like they did a year ago as they punched their ticket to the big dance. Officially this past Saturday, they tied with Hawaii as co-conference champions in the regular season after getting a win at Riverside and the Bows fell to Long Beach State. But for the Anteaters, they do get the two seed as Hawaii had the tiebreaker. UCI will tip off the quarterfinal round this Thursday in Anaheim against Cal Poly. I don't really think their record really reflects how good they are. Uh, this is a team that all, most of their losses have been by less than five points this year. And, you know, I just, I think we, we can't go in there underestimating them because I think, especially in our conference, any game, every game is pretty tough. So I think we just need to shore up the stuff that we struggled with last time and then keep doing what made us successful as well. We respect that program a lot. You know, as, as you said, the, we lost them a couple years ago, my freshman year. So that's definitely on our minds, especially, I know some coaches, you know, takes that personally and he's kind of, He's kind of trying to filter that through us and make, make sure we take it personally as well because uh, they can end our season and we have to respect, give them the respect that they deserve and come out and play our best. Every possession is huge and you know this is the time of the month where you know teams are putting their all hearts out on the court and we just want to get that win you know we just want to make it to the NCAA double tournament that's every team's dream and we made it last year and we're just hoping to make it again this year. So for the Anteaters, if they want to get back to the NCAA tournament, they'll have to do what they did a year ago at the Honda Center, and that's win three games in three days. They certainly have the experienced team to do it, and all those guys remember, of course, the history they made a year ago. I think our experience, like you said, helps us with that a lot. You know, not just, not just in March, but just we've been in a lot of close games this year and in the past with this group, and I think if it comes down to the end, I think that's going to help us out a lot. We definitely have that experience and I think we have that resilience as well. You know, we have a lot of high character guys on our team and I think we have enough to make it happen. Conference tournament time, March, this is what it's all about, right? This is what it's all about, man. The fun, the madness, it's 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 what everyone dreams of, you know, and I think and I think we're ready and we're gonna play we're gonna play our hearts out and we're gonna give everything we got. An exciting time in college basketball around the country. Conference tournament time where dreams are made and also dreams are crushed. But the Anteaters looking to defend their conference tournament championship starting this Thursday as they'll tee it up with Cal Poly in the quarterfinal round. That'll be a 6 o'clock start. Hope to see you at the Honda Center and all through the weekend, Anteater fans.